Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about Domain Relational Calculus. In Domain Relational Calculus, domain variables are used. Domain variables take on values from an attribute's domain. An expression in the Domain Relational Calculus is of this form, where x1, x2, x3 up to xn are domain variables and P is a condition or formula of the domain relational calculus. A formula is made up of atoms. An atom in the domain relational calculus can be one of the following forms. First is an atom of this form, where x1, x2, x3 up to xj are domain variables and r is the name of the relation. This atom states that the list of values of x1, x2, x3 up to xj must be a tuple in the relation whose name is r. Second is an atom of this form xi of xj. Here xi and xj are domain variables and op is a comparison operator like less than, less than equal to, equal to, not equal to, greater than and greater than equal to. Third is an atom of this form xi of c or c of xj. Here xi and xj are domain variables and op is a comparison operator like less than, less than equal to, equal to, not equal to, greater than and greater than equal to and c is a constant value a formula is built from atoms by these rules an atom is a formula if P1 is a formula, then this expression, not P1, is also a formula. If P1 and P2 are formulas, then P1 and P2 and P1 or P2 are also formulas. If P1 is a formula, then this expression and this expression are also formulas where x is a domain variable. Now see this domain relational calculus query. This domain relational calculus query lists the loan number of all loans with an amount greater than 1000. This is the loan relation. In this query, we need three variables. One to range over each of the domains of attributes of the loan relation. In this expression, only variable L is free because it appears to the left of the bar. Requested attribute loan number is specified by the free domain variable L. Attribute branch is specified by the domain variable B and attribute amount is specified by the domain variable A. 
condition for selecting a tuple is specified following the bar condition for selecting the tuple in this query is that the sequence of values assigned to the variables l b a must be a tuple of the loan relation and the value of a must be greater than 1000 thank you very much